Hello, I'm Adam from Tati Bikes and welcome to our Snail Cam Setup Tip video. So I'm just going to run you through quickly how we're going to go about it. First off, we set up the drive side Snail Cam and then we're going to pull the wheel into the centre using the non-drive side cam. So you can see here that the chain at the moment is quite loose and floppy. It means you don't sort of get a great feeling out of pedalling. So the first thing we need to do is loosen off both of the axle bolts. A couple of turns on each to make sure you've got plenty of room to play with. So working on the drive side Snail Cam first. Push that all the way back until the chain is nice and tight. You can usually get a couple of clicks when the chain's this loose. And there we go. And then from here, if you rotate the cranks back slowly, you can see the chain dipping at one point. So we've got a low spot there, and then a tight spot there. So if we work at the loose spot, that allows us to get the best tension on the chain. So now we can probably get one more click on this drive side snail cam. Then from here, just nip up the axle bolt. It doesn't have to be super tight because we're going to check everything square first of all. And at this point the wheel is not going to be centred, so you need to use the non-drive side snail cam to pull the wheel back into the centre between the brakes. And then nip up the axle bolt. Again, doesn't need to be super tight. So final thing, just check the chain tension. If you pull the chain fairly hard, it should touch the chain stay. If it's too loose, it'll flop around and hit the seat stay. And if it's too tight, it can damage the rear hub bearings and the bottom bracket bearings. Just make sure the crank spin back with nice and freely and the wheel moves forward through the brakes without a problem. And the one final thing to make sure you don't forget is get the axle bolts nice and tight. Use a good quality Allen key if you can. That allows you to get plenty of torque on the bolt and that'll stop the wheel sliding around and moving while you're riding. And there we go. Good to go.